In the dense, fog-wrapped forests of West Virginia near the shadow of Spruce Knob, a group of five friends embarked on a camping adventure they hoped would etch unforgettable memories. Little did they know, their journey would become a terrifying encounter with the legendary Mothman, plunging them into a night of horror they'd never forget. The group, armed with backpacks brimming with camping gear, traversed the rugged terrain, laughing and sharing stories. As the sun dipped below the horizon, casting a golden glow, they found the perfect spot to set up camp. The crackling fire soon bathed them in warmth as they settled in for the night, oblivious to the malevolent eyes watching from the darkness beyond the firelight. The night grew deep, and an eerie silence enveloped the camp. The forest seemed to hold its breath. Suddenly, a bone-chilling scream shattered the stillness. It was an unfathomable sound, neither animal nor human. Panic seeped into their hearts. As they huddled closer, the whispers began. A soft, menacing murmur that seemed to circle their camp, closing in. Tentative footsteps led two of the friends, Alex and Jamie, into the darkness with flashlights in hand, seeking the source of the unsettling whispers. What they found instead were eyes. Red, glowing orbs floating in the shadows, watching, waiting. The sight rooted them to the spot. The legendary Mothman of West Virginia folklore was no longer just a tale. It was there, in the flesh, wings shrouded by the night, its gaze piercing their very souls. The camp descended into chaos as the creature attacked, its wings stirring a gale that extinguished their fires and plunged them into darkness. Its shrieks filled the air, a sound of impending doom. The friends scattered, lost and alone, their screams echoing through the forest. As they sought refuge among the dense underbrush and towering trees, they began to realize the horrifying truth. The Mothman was toying with them. It could have taken them at any moment, but it seemed to relish in their fear, in the hunt. In their desperate flight, Sarah, the most resourceful among them, stumbled upon ancient ruins, overgrown and forgotten. In the moonlight, she deciphered petroglyphs depicting the Mothman, a guardian of these lands, awakened now by their trespass. The realization came with a heavy heart. They were not just battling a creature, but disturbing a sacred balance. The group reunited at the ruins, driven together by an instinct to survive. Together, they devised a plan. Using their knowledge from the petroglyphs and the resources at hand, they set out to appease the creature, crafting an offering to honor it, to quell its wrath. As the Mothman descended upon them for the last time, the forest seemed to stand still. The offering was presented, and the beast hesitated, its glowing eyes softening. A bone-deep growl reverberated through the air, not of anger, but acknowledgement. With a final, lingering look, the Mothman spread its massive wings and ascended into the night sky, disappearing into the celestial unknown. As dawn broke over Spruce Knob, the friends, forever changed, made their way out of the forest. They left behind the wilderness, with its secrets and shadows, carrying with them a story that would transcend their generation. A tale of fear, respect, and the ancient guardian known as the Mothman. Their adventure had turned into a nightmare, but in the end, they emerged from the darkness, a testament to the human spirit's resilience. And though they vowed never to return, the legend of that night and their encounter with the Mothman would haunt them for the rest of their days, a chilling reminder of the mysteries that lie in the heart of West Virginia's forests. In the heart of the dark, foreboding forests of rural West Virginia, a small group of soldiers found themselves on a routine training mission. 
The air was thick with an eerie stillness, and the dense foliage seemed to press in on them from all sides. Little did they know that they were not alone in those woods. As night began to fall, the soldiers set up camp, their nerves already frayed from the oppressive atmosphere of the forest. Suddenly, a shrill, unearthly screech pierced the air, causing the soldiers to tighten their grips on their weapons. Whispers of a creature known as Mothman began to circulate among the group, sending shivers down their spines. One by one, the soldiers began to disappear into the shadows, their terrified cries echoing through the trees. Each time one vanished, the remaining soldiers felt a cold dread seep into their bones, knowing that they were next. Panic gripped the group as they realized they were being hunted by a malevolent force beyond their comprehension. As the survivors frantically tried to find their way out of the forest, they were plagued by nightmarish visions and hallucinations. The line between reality and terror blurred as the darkness closed in around them, each step forward feeling like a descent into madness. Just when they thought they could go no further, they stumbled upon a clearing bathed in an otherworldly light. There, looming before them, was the dreaded Mothman, its eyes glowing with an unholy light. With a deafening screech, it lunged towards them, its wings beating against the night air like a specter of doom. In a final act of desperation, the two soldiers unleashed a hail of bullets at the creature, their shots ringing out through the forest. As the echoes faded away, they saw the Mothman falter, its form dissipating into the shadows like a wisp of smoke. With trembling hands, they emerged from the forest, the horror of their ordeal etched into their souls forever. To this day, the tale of the soldiers who faced the Mothman in the dark woods of West Virginia is whispered in hushed tones, a chilling reminder of the terrors that lurk in the unseen corners of the world. In the hushed, eerie nights of Point Pleasant, West Virginia, amidst the whispers of trees and the silent chorus of the Ohio River, there laid a secret, a harbinger of chaos, known only to those unfortunate enough to encounter it. The Mothman, a creature of terrifying legend, became the central figure of a story so spine-chilling it has etched itself into the very soul of the town. Our story begins on a fog-laden evening in late October, with a young couple, Sarah and Alex, seeking adventure in the innocently deceiving beauty of Point Pleasant's secluded roads. The promise of an isolated spot by the river, known only to locals and whispered about in hushed tones, drew them away from the safety of the town's glowing lights into the embrace of the dark. Driving an old, barely trustworthy sedan, they navigated through the dense fog, the headlights barely cutting through the opacity, creating an otherworldly glow. Suddenly, Alex slammed the brakes, heart racing as a figure loomed ahead. It vanished as quickly as it appeared, leaving only the lingering sense of dread. Laughing off the unease, attributing it to the mist and their imaginations, they continued, unaware they had just crossed paths with the Mothman. At their destination, the car parked with the river's soft murmurs for company. They settled into an uneasy camaraderie with the night. The windows slightly down to let the autumn air whisper secrets, their conversation was light, a facade to mask the growing unease. Without warning, the serene night exploded into chaos. A deafening shriek shattered the air, a sound so otherworldly it seemed to freeze their very souls, halting their breaths. The car shook violently as if gripped by an unseen force, windows fogging instantly, obscuring the outer world and trapping them in a vortex of fear. Through the fogged glass, a shadow loomed, colossal wings unfolding, red eyes piercing the darkness, burning through the mist. The Mothman. It was no longer a legend whispered in the safety of daylight, but a terrifying reality, an entity of incomprehensible horror. 
Frozen in terror, Sarah and Alex could only watch as the creature unleashed another ear-splitting cry, the car's metal frame groaning under the pressure of its unseen power. And then, as quickly as the chaos had erupted, it ceased. The creature vanished, leaving a heavy silence that thundered louder than its shrieks. Heartbeats thunderous in their ears, they sat paralyzed, afraid that any movement would summon the creature back from the shadows. Time became abstract, the line between seconds and eternity blurred until, driven by a primal urge for survival, Alex turned the key in the ignition. The car, as if understanding the urgency, roared to life, breaking the spell that held them captive. They drove back to Point Pleasant, a silent pact between them to never speak of what occurred, a futile attempt to deny the reality of their encounter. The Mothman became their shadow, a specter in their lives, its red eyes a constant presence felt but never seen. The terror of that night lingered, a haunting melody that played on loop in their minds. Whispers in the dark had become their unwelcome companion, a reminder of the night when the boundary between legend and reality blurred, a night that would forever haunt the sleepy town of Point Pleasant, West Virginia. This detailed story encapsulates the horror and mystery surrounding the Mothman, blending the terrifying elements of legend with the visceral fear of the unknown, turning an ordinary night into an encounter with the extraordinary.